It is a game break presented by Casamigos Tequila. We are getting ready for Stephen Curry. Chef. Averages over 6, 36 points per game against the Lakers this year. The play-in tournament, the seeding, it will all be impacted tonight. LeBron will be playing, according to our Chris Haynes. We are still in Studio J, and we are processing. Before, some interesting observations from our viewers. Jamal Crawford, this man's facial structure is a little a work of art. The positive, and now the negative. Adam Lefko's ankles looking thick in them socks. Oh, John. Very official hashtags. But yes, Come on, Jack Don't Ryan. Gonna Rap ever again. He's certified pay homage. Go back to the one on top. Nah, why are you so snickering? Why, 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 why are you snickering like, like that? It said, this is a Jamal Crawford appreciation tweet. This man's facial structure is a literal work of art. Who's Let's do from? a slow zoom on hey. camera th or camera four in the Jamal Hey, go to, go to left coast cankles. That was unnecessary. <laughs> Who's it from? That was from. Uh, there they that's, are. That's there. Not a, there, there they go. There they go. There they go. Look at that. Look, it gets thinner there. Uh, Who tweeted that to Jamal? Super. That's what I'm, I am. What, I am Jess. That? It said a rich auntie in training. I checked it out on Twitter. Okay, cool. Okay. It's official, Shaq. Don't hate. Uh, Why are you laughing, dog? This dude here. Uh, we are having fun, but I will tell you right now, the people of Milwaukee are sitting on pins and needles. What we saw in this game in the second half is a sight that we never want to see. A non-contact moment in which Giannis was running after passing in an out-of-bounds ball and then immediately reached, tested, and then was helped to the locker room. The Milwaukee Bucks have come out and said that they are calling it a calf injury. I would recommend and tell you that this will take time and we will see what happens. He did walk very gingerly, putting some pressure on it, as you see here, to the locker room. Thanasis walking with him, Brooke Lopez walking with him. But he is walking, and this is, anytime you see something like that, there's a lot of guesses that we can make. Giannis will not return tonight's game. Uh, I'm not gonna. Soleus. Soleus. Got you. Have you experienced a Soleus strain before? No, but I know where my Soleus is. Is that a calf? It's, it's like in the front. The front calf. Yeah, it's like, well, I don't think there's a front calf, but. Yeah, there is a front calf. Thank you. There is a front calf? Perfectly. Oh, oh there's yeah. not a front calf. It's I do, your soleus. I do want to say this. This is information because when you see someone go non-contact, the first thought is the worst thought, which is Achilles. March, in the beginning of March, March 3rd and 8th, Giannis missed the game on March 4th with Achilles tendonitis. He was listed on three different injury reports in that span from March 3rd to 8th with just sore Achilles. This is being reported as a calf strain, but our fear as we watched it was it could be a lot more severe than that. For sure, it's, it's all attached. The kinetic chain of, of your calf, your Achilles, that whole area. Um, the scary part about it was his face. And if you look at it, it was like a shock when he went down. Like he was like, what was that? And that part was really, really scary. We won't know, we're not gonna speculate, but even if it's not anything serious, that thought is in the back of your mind. Right. If you're a player, because I had calf injuries before. I missed time with it before. I'm not going to speculate on injuries. <clears throat> I think that the promising thing for me, too, was that he didn't just grab the back when he Very laid there. True. He grabbed kind of the front, which tells me that, you know, obviously is soleus or whatever they're, they're reporting. So I think any time there's a non-contact injury, oh, it's, so it's scary, um, and especially the way that Giannis plays. Um, but just hoping for the best for him and for the Bucks. We do have a uh, video that just came out moments ago of him walking out. So this is him right now. I guess this was towards the end of the game, watching the end of the game. He is putting some weight on, as you can see, uh, but it's it does okay. look tough. And, and even if this is the calf strain, we are six games, six days away from the playoffs starting. And this is a superstar of a franchise that you want to be healthy, Shaquille O'Neal. I hate to have to correct you, Candace, but the uh, soleus is in the back of the posterior calf. Dr. Dr. O'Neal coming. Anyway, uh, we hope it's what a calf What is the opposite train. of posterior? Uh, he ain't that kind of doctor. <laughs> Come on, bro. You he ain't that kind of anterior. doctor. Anterior. I know that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> no, I, I was just trying to gather my thoughts. Hopefully it is a calf strain. Uh, I had a moment like that where, you know, look, most of the people that have popped their Achilles tendon, it's a non-contact thing, and you're running, and it feels like something snapped. Yeah, someone kicked you in the back. Yeah, something. Jamal talked about the look. That's the look he had. But yeah, you know, for him to be able to, you know, put pressure on like that, hopefully it is. Uh, you, know, you had you had something similar with your calf.
He tore yeah. his Achilles. Yeah, no, I no, I tore my Achilles my last game of my career in uh, Boston. I was running just like that out of bounds. You see how he grabs the front, so, though? He did uh, grab the front. <clears throat> yeah, but the soleus is not the front. The yeah, back. but then right there. But the side, it's like right here. That's the soleus. Soleus is in the back of the posterior calf. All right. okay. it According is. to the Medical Journal of Atlanta Medical Society of Medical <laughs> Medical. <laughs> It was a big win for the Milwaukee Bucks. They win this one by 13. No, but I hope he's okay, though. Yeah, yeah, me too. Yeah, the we entire do. season changes. This is a face of the league. This is an NBA champion. This is an advocate for a global scale. We are all hoping that it is just a calf strain that Giannis is okay. And, and he means more to the game than just the Bucks. Like, worldwide, Giannis is... He's one of those guys. He maximizes every, every time he's on the court. He maximizes the work ethic. He maximizes his... his, his uh, his drive, like everything there is, is he does it the right way. So we hope it's nothing serious. And it reports now to ESPN that Antetokounmpo will undergo an MRI on that left calf. That will take some time and see. But the Bucks did win this game again. They needed to win because, again, <clears throat> they lose some games. They could have gone from the two seed down to the six seed. And Pat Bev, if I would have told you before the game, Pat Beverly was going to lead the Bucks in scoring. Is the Pat Bev game? I think it was the Pat Bev game. He even got to shout out his podcast in the post-game interview. Brooke Lopez, five threes in the first half of He's this He's on one. fire. He's no, heating up. He's on fire. Did you play NBA Jam? I sure did. Damian Lillard adding to it. Damian Lillard had two threes tonight. Giannis getting the roll there. Look at the score. They're up 20 in the first half, now 22. Bobby Portis, a sixth man of oh. the year candidate. Blowing there by Christian. Oh, that's, 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 that's a Walker shimmy. That's a 12 Walker shimmy. Oh. A little bit. That's shimmy shango. Oh, oh, just dunk it then. Nerf hoop. Antoine shimmy is special. This oh, right give here. Me that oh. leg off the ground like that. That had a chance to do special. Jalen Brown getting the steal, going for the dunk. Giannis showing you why he's an all NBA defensive player nearly every year. Second half, Milwaukee looking to maintain this lead. Pat Beth. Four threes on the game for him. This was the moment oh. that we were just talking about. Grabbing his left leg, going down, would leave, would not return. The soleus, the muscle in question. And he's going back to the posterior calf. Now, Boston trying to take advantage. Spin move, baseline, Tatum slams it home down to just 14. Down to 13. Jason Tatum getting it going again. Jalen Brown. A lot of these plays, you're like, no foul. A lot of contact. Mm. We'll get into a historic. Okay, Chris. Amount of free throws attempt. Refs Chris getting playoff ready too. Yes, he is. Bucks 104, Boston 91. And in terms of free throws, it is the fewest that we have had in decades. Two free throws attempted by the Bucks, zero free throws attempted by the Boston Celtics. I repeat, the Boston Celtics went zero for zero from the free throw line, the Milwaukee Bucks one for two. It is not just an anomaly. This is truly a number that will likely never happen again, what you've just witnessed on TNT. Since the 82-83 season, the fewest up to this point was 11, just two. Well, Lefko, there were only 12 foul calls in this entire game as well, which is crazy. The refs are getting playoff ready. I mean, the refs are getting playoff ready? They or playoff were they ready. just not touching anybody on defense? <laughs> like, it just seemed like there was a lot of, like, wide open yeah, layups or wide open play. threes. Yeah, and they, and they let them. You know, it was a lot of fouls that should have been called, but they were very consistent not calling those fouls, and they let them play. Getting ready for the playoffs. Shaq, like, I, Shaq like likes it that play. way. Yeah, yeah when exactly. It's oh, a 90s ball. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because you're built for that. So I, I think I know how to stop the Celtics in the playoffs. And it's not You do? Be, I do. I figured it out. What? The Boston Celtics are now 62 and 17. On TNT, they're 4 and 7. That's how you're going to stop so them it's in the playoffs? Us. If they're. I'm going to blame Candace. And so, Boston, no. I apologize. <laughs> See, now Where that can is weird. You know what it, it is? It's bad luck, Charles Barkley. You think it was Charles? It's bad luck, Barkley. That BLB. BLB? Bad luck, Barkley. BLB. Not BBL, but BLB. It's very BBL. true. If you guys have issues with the Barkley Boston Celtics issues. Barkley has a BBL, issues. too. It's the same thing. Barkley got a BBL? Oh, yeah, he got a BBL. Jumping around. And uh, we're going to talk to the break. LeBron James is playing. There goes the Lakers, man. the Warriors. Coming up next on TNT.